Hey guys, it's me. I was kinda hoping Christian would join me with this one, but uh... Oh, and yes, the uh, Mickey ears are probably gonna get annoying even to me doing this, but uh... I figure... It's uh... But I'm saving or moving them for a joke about how ridiculous Next Mutation was in a future video. That should give you ideas of what that one is. Uh, and it's time for another... Or, I guess, usually when I do this, it's Disney vs. Warner Brothers vs. Nickelodeon. So just a Disney vs. Nickelodeon, I guess. Though this show wasn't technically Nickelodeon, but since... Nickelodeon bought it and started airing Ninja Turtles. It started advertising it as such, so we'll pretend it is, I guess. Um, comparison. This one is Gargoyles versus the 80s Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Now, for this, I'm going to be using all, t all 10 Ninja Turtles seasons and the first two Gargoyles seasons. That may seem unfair, but trust me, we're better off if I give Goliath Chronicles its own comparison. Similarities... Both are about non-human main characters, the Gargoyles and the Turtles. Both were super popular in the 90s. So Ninja Turtles started in the 80s, but its popularity was big in the 90s as well, though. Um, both have the uh, natural-born leader, Goliath and Leonardo. Both have the tech whiz, Lexington and Donatello. Both have the uh, goofy, no pun intended, type character. Uh... Broadway and Michelangelo. Both have a character heavily associated with the color red. Brooklyn and Raphael. Both have a human main character. A, a human female main character. Elisa Maza and April O'Neil. Whose profession is important to their character in multiple episodes. Uh, Elisa is a cop and April is a reporter. Both have the wise old mentors, Hudson and Splinter. Uh, both first episodes I thought of these shows I thought were similar even as a kid. Uh, like the human main character befriends the non-human characters and I just thought it was kind of similar even as a kid or both first episodes were um both have a villain who wants to both have a main villain who wants to take over the world uh Demona and Shredder <coughs> Both have a villainous duo. Whoa, who's yeah. Jekyll and I Hy Jekyll and Hyena, Bebop and Rocksteady. Um etc. So which wins? This is a tough one. I grew up with both shows. I love both shows. Uh however. Given the choice, I'm probably going to go with Gargoyles. It wasn't afraid to get uh, downright darker or more serious at times. Sure, you could say the same thing about the 80s Ninja Turtles, but that was more applicable to the 2003 one. Though I will say, uh, re-watching all the Turtles shows, <laughs> the Turtles in the 80s show definitely acted the most like teenagers. Um, but yeah, still, even with that in mind, uh, since we're not counting the Goliath Chronicles for this one, Gargoyles wins.
winner Disney. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe if you want to. And if you do, turn on those post notifications so you never miss a video. Comment below which one of these cartoons you guys liked more. And I'll see you next time. Bye.